Air is crucial for thousands of families across our state, and this morning, rallies will continue for the third annual morning without child care. Channel 3's Olivia Schuler joins us now live from one of the rally locations in the Elm City. Olivia, good morning. So, why are these events taking place? Kate, good morning. Well, these rallies are designed to draw attention to the need for increased funding within the child care system. Now, child care is a necessity for many families across our state. Advocates say more funding would increase the amount of high-quality programs, teacher salaries, and affordable tuition for families. Today, state leaders, families, and educators will speak on the overwhelming need for change. The Child Care for Connecticut's Future is spearheading the event in towns and cities across our state. As a group, the coalition wants Governor Ned Lamont and lawmakers to invest in child care long term. That would include approving parts of a $2 billion plan by the governor's blue ribbon panel. The bill is designed to increase pay for workers while decreasing tuition. In fact, the coalition believes child care should be capped at 7% of a family's annual income. Now, rallies are scheduled to take place in areas across our state this morning into the afternoon. Here in New Haven, the rally will be starting at 8 o'clock on the town's green, and everyone is welcome to come to share their thoughts and feelings about the state's current situation with child care. We're live this morning in New Haven, Olivia Schuler, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.